John Little here for SpasuAthletics.com along with uh, Rod Camper, a guy who's getting a lot of attention uh, here in the postseason after a great season for the Swasu Bulldog men's basketball team. Rod, uh, and you just found out uh, this week, or we found out, that you're going to be part of the uh, D2 All-Star game as well yes, out at the Elite Eight. Uh, yes, how did you get that call? How did that transpire? Yeah, uh, coach, actually, Coach called me on the phone, and he had Coach Petisi on the phone, and he just was like, uh, Rod, congratulations, more awards keep coming. I just said, appreciate it, but I, I like all these uh, uh, accomplishments and awards and stuff, but I couldn't have done it without my team. Absolutely. Yeah. What, what are you most looking forward to when you think about playing in this game on Friday? Just the competition. I know it's like the top top players uh, across the country. And plus, I played against one of them uh, that's playing against the team I'm playing against. So, yeah, I'm on the East and he on the West. So, it's going to be pretty good. Well, it'll be a lot of fun to watch, yeah. you know. Uh, as you uh, and, and like you said, you know, you could not have done it without your team this year. What do you think uh, that you and the rest of the seniors, you know, Mike and Ante, kind of helped leave for this program? You know, we're sitting in a in a beautiful new facility. That's yeah. one thing. You know, um, obviously there are a lot of wins this year yeah. uh, for you guys as well. But what do you think you helped leave for the program? We helped leave like uh, just. Hard work and leadership. Like between me, Mike, and Ante, we set a good leadership role for the team. We was great leaders. We uh, was good captains, and like that just goes to show you that like they they respected us. So they can bring in like the recruits that saw us practice and the recruits that saw us play, and they seen how we lead the team. They just say, "Uh, oh, this is a very organized program." Absolutely. You know, for you going into your senior season, you had a choice to make. Am I going to, you know, just kind of coast to the end, let it, you know, not really um, worry about it too much, just kind of enjoy my senior year, so to speak. <laughs> not that you didn't enjoy it, but you chose the, the hard path, the, the hard work, being a leader, challenging yourself. Why was that the path that you chose to take? Because last, my junior year season was a disappointment. We had all the talent in the world, but the record and how well we played, we didn't mesh together, so... That experience carried over to this year. And I was just determined to win. Like everybody loved winning. I loved winning myself. Now, what about uh, Rod Camper? Are you trying to take your game once you graduate to the to kind of a pro level, or what's your plan there? Oh yeah, so I'm trying to play professional basketball. I just recently got an agent, so me and him working on things. But I got the resume to do it, so. I just got to let my game speak for itself. Absolutely, and a big part of that is the uh, D2 All-Star Game coming up on Friday uh, out there in Indiana, Evansville, Indiana, as part of the Elite Eight. Rod, congratulations on all the honors coming your way. They're very well deserved. Thank you. That's Rod Camper. I'm John Little for SwasuAthletics.com.